Alright, so where are we going? Hmm. Oh, Shuichi's room. Doi. Huh? If something's the matter. Oh, game, you better fucking not. Oh! Ah, oh, Jesus Christ! Don't do that to me, you fucking game! Oh, God! Oh. Fuck you. God damn it. Please. You finally came out. You had me nervous for a second. Sorry. Oh, sorry, I was just going to the bathroom. Are you ready then? Yes, let's get the okay. cameras. Let's go. Freaking go. The game freaking bamboozled me. God damn it. <laughs> they make me care and then uh Yeah. Uh did I get a friendship shard from you the first time? Yeah, I did. I got a friendship shard. Uh what oh, AMG. Hey. You wanna spend your final moments? <laughs> Maybe you wanna pray to Atua with me? Oh, what? You shouldn't be giving up so easily. <laughs> true, true. <laughs> Just a prank, bro. <laughs> this is what happens when you try to be friends with people. <laughs> this is going to be Gazoon Tycoon all over again, isn't it? I, I don't know. Maybe. Uh, it seems you overreacted there, buddy. Well, I was afraid. Damn it. Huh? What are you talking about? Atua has spoken. In such dire times, why won't he stop fighting? Huh? They're fighting in the dining hall. Atu is really bummed what? out about- Wait, what? Who's fighting? Shuichi. Is someone fighting in the dining hall? Alright, we need to go take Wait a look at what's me. going on. You go get the cameras, and we'll meet up at the classroom by the stairs to the basement. Yeah. Sounds good. Ah, uh, come pray with me, one of us. Come pray with me, one of us. One of us. Um. <laughs> mm -hmm. Alright, Angie, you with me. Let's go. We're gonna stop this, whatever, whatever this is. Ah, uh, there's someone all the way over here. On the side of the... Side of the building. Hi! What are you doing all the way over here? Uh, okay. Uh, Stay out of it. What? Why? Um, I see. Start the killing game? <laughs> well! Oh. Hmm. Alright, let's hurry. Reverse! Reverse! Forward! It was blocked. Oh, crap. It's blocked. Uh, there's somebody else over here, too. Just side shuffle. Oh, God. It's you. No, I'm not talking to you. Screw you. I don't want to talk to you. Okay. What's going on? Hey. Oh, okay. I had a perfect timing. <laughs> Monokuma appeared again in the in the boss fight. <laughs> Rip, baby Hitler. I really don't know what to do, Kaede. We almost started talking crazy. <laughs> All I was doing was making a suggestion. Come back, musical. I have stuff to show you. <laughs> so that more people can survive, even if it's just one more. Why? What are you saying, dude? Um. So that more people can survive. Ryoma, what do you mean by that? Don't you get it? Don't you get it? If time runs out like this, we'll all get annihilated, you know. The only way to avoid that is to play along with this killing game. Huh? So who do you want to kill? Oh, well, that makes things easy. Here, bend over. Huh? Ryoma, what are you saying? Sheesh. You don't get that either. I'm saying that I'll give you guys my life. I... I don't have a reason to live anymore. Well? So if the rest of you want to live, I'll hand my life over to you. That's wrong. No way. We promised we'd all get out of here together. <laughs> what? Whoa! <laughs> I hoped it'd end that way. That's why I waited so long to bring this up. 
We've just been waiting for the deadline without doing anything to change it. In other words... There's no more time left for idealism, don't you think? Uh, no, it's not idealism. However... This is the best choice. Uh, whoever murders me gets to leave without a trial. Everyone else survives the time limit. Uh, happy role-playing. <laughs> Kill me, not fuck me. <laughs> well, I mean, who knows? Could both be the same thing. Uh, whoever murders me gets to leave without a trial. Everyone else survives. After that, the person who gets to escape can go for help and rescue everyone else. Well? If you got a better idea, I'd love to hear it. Um. Um, well. Yeah, that went dark all of a sudden. It really did. What should I do? Maybe if I share Shuichi's plan with him, Ryoma will change his mind. Actually, Ryoma, there's no need for that. Hmm. I'm going to end. There's this no game. need for that because I'm going to end this game. I've made my decision. What are you doing? Huh? Hey. Uh, gamer Ryoma will give his life. What a little blood in comparison. Take his blood, goddammit. He won't need it anymore. It's not about outfoxing everyone in the killing game. It's about ending the game itself. That's the real goal. However. Can you even accomplish such a feat? Oh, well, yeah. I wouldn't be saying this if I didn't think I could. Then. And how will you end it? You understand that the time limit expires tonight, yes? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. I can't tell you. Actually, if I could, I wouldn't be having so much trouble. Mm -hmm. Uh, yeah, post it in the Discord, Morgana. I'm going to end this game. Just what I said. I'm going to end this game. Get it? So don't any of you go and do anything unnecessary, all right? Look at his fucking face. Dude, what is up what? with you? You've still got a ways to go. <laughs> got it. I take back my suggestion. Do what you want. Whether you guys live or die is up to you. That's a shame. Um. What is this guy right now? Were you serious when you said you knew a way to end this yeah. game? Not sure? Huh? How should I Well, even this? if I did, I have an idea. I couldn't tell you. Can't risk anyone interfering. Prayer time. Okie dokie. Then Angie will pray for your strategy success, Rantaro. <laughs> punished. But if you're lying, Atua says he'll punish you for three generations to come. Okay. <laughs> he looks like a Hope Bagel 2.0 for me. I don't know. He's not He's not all about hope. He's definitely a bagel of some sort. God, now I want bagels. Ugh. I'm hungry. But... Ending this game. Is that even possible? Can we call him Hope Donut? No, that would have been that would have been Asahina. Donut Donut is reserved for her. Uh, I suspect he only said that to defuse the situation and stop Ryoma. I mean, ending this game? <laughs> Maybe his hidden town is actually a huge explosion. <laughs> He's the ultimate explosion. That could take many different meanings. Uh, we don't have much time left. I need to do something. Let's go meet up with Shuichi. That's what we need to do. You don't like the cosplaying girl? <laughs> well, I mean, I haven't really spent much time with her. He's a hope biscuit! Well, I mean... It's not really hope, though. That's the problem. I mean, I don't know that yet. Oh, hi, Gonta. What happened? This face looks scary. No, yeah, they got into a fight. No. Sorry. No. Yeah. That's right. Yeah, they're in the dining hall. Go eat breakfast. Oh, going to see. We'll see you later, dude. The hope pancake. I, I know everybody keeps trying to do hope, but it's it's the adjective, not the actual noun. He could still be a bagel. It's just Wait, what? Oh, in the classroom. Bye. The baseball. Okay, this thing. He could still be a bagel, it's just we don't know what kind of adjective describes his bageliness. It could be called the Hope Avocado. Shuichi. God damn it. No. Oh, God. Um, Did she finish what? the cameras? She was even too tired to make fun of me. Anyway, here's the result. Two cameras that will take a picture when the sensor detects movement. Remember. And this one will take a picture and trigger this receiver. Of course, they're turned off right now, so they aren't taking any pictures. Hmm. No. I see. Oh, the wine automatically. Oh, cool. Okay. The unknown bagel. Yeah, I guess so. I see. They 
completely silent. This is perfect. Well, it needs to be. These are absolutely essential for our plan. Uh, and do these cameras have flashes? That's... Yeah, they still have flashes on them, but I switched them off. It shouldn't be a problem. Hopefully it's not too dark right. in there. That's right. Mm -hmm. I'm impressed, though. Mio modified them to our specifications. Then... All right, I'll tell you a little bit about this classroom before we set up in the library. Huh? Wait, what? Why? Is that all right? Oh, this is the place where we should keep watch. That's true. Because we can see anyone who goes down to the basement with the door open a little. Look, you can see the staircase, right? Yeah, we can. Yeah, you're right. We can keep a lookout for anyone who goes down to the basement. Hey. There's one more reason I chose this specific classroom. And what would that be, dude? Hey. Something that's only here? What's here? The blackboard? Oh, hello. I almost missed you. An air vent. That's... It's connected to the library in the basement. You'll recognize the smell immediately. Ah-ha! Mm. Ah. Doesn't he sound like Shinji from P3? I don't know. Not really. Uh, after Shuichi told me that, I leaned into closer to the vent. Uh. Musty old books. Well... Remember. I see. Hmm. Uh, um. Hmm. Yeah. He does it the same VA? Hmm. Interesting. Then. It's finally time to set our plan in motion. Oh, cool, it is the same VA. Nice. He sounds completely different. Cool. Uh, better check at the list, and I recommend looking at that list after the first cheer. Uh, oh, after, I mean, after the first chapter? Fair enough. Okay, I mean, I'm not going to look at that right away. First trial. Hey, we just hit a new level. Hey. All right, where are we gonna place these? The moving bookcase. And when it opens, it'll let us know. Okay. Yeah, the camera should capture the exact moment the mastermind moves the bookcase. Then where are we putting the other two sensors? Remember. Well, there are two entrances to the library. The front entrance near the stairs and the rear entrance to the hallway. Let's aim one at each entrance. That way we'll have pictures of everyone who enters the library. Huh? Um. Ooh! Hey. That's a fair point! That's... Well, yeah, we'll be in the classroom, but... We should investigate it a little more. The sand on how about this ladder? This conveniently placed ladder. Whoa. Now that I'm up here, this is pretty high. It's kind of scary. Do you want to switch? I love the music notes on her skirt. That's adorable. Nah, I'm fine. By the way, can you see my um delicates? Oh no. Uh, sorry. Sorry. We did see them. <laughs> what do you expect? He can't unsee them. He can't unsee them. Well, anyway, this is the vent. There's a grate covering the vent, so I don't think anyone can go through. Can I take the grate off? Uh, there we go. Oh, the grate came off pretty easily. Did you break something, Kaede? Um, no. I didn't break it. He probably thinks I'm a klutz. I pushed the grate into the duct, and I lifted my body and looked inside. So how's it look? Could a person fit in there? Hmm. Hmm. It would be pretty difficult, but you might be able to crawl through. I can't really get to the vent with all these books in the way, though. Well, we'll be able to see the entrance to the vent in the classroom. Hmm, fair enough. So that should be okay, right? Just in case, I'll stack more books around the vent so no one can get through. 
All right, we'll arrange the books and call it good. After I finish stacking the books, I climb down the ladder. Are you okay? Yeah. Huh? Got it? Oh, might actually protect everyone. This plan is perfectly composed like Chopin's ballads. You know? I actually really like complicated contraptions, like Ruba Goldberg machines and stuff. So I'm positive this will work. The setup is perfect. Uh, um... All right, sure. We'll catch the mastermind and then we'll all escape. All right. Then. Uh. What if we place a camera up there? I'm sure the mastermind wouldn't notice it. But, ah, but with all the books stacked up on top, I don't know if there's room for the camera. You know. Then I'll test it out while you prepare the sensor on the bookcase. I'll organize the books on top of the bookcase and see if I can make room for a camera. All right. All right, let's do it. Hmm. All right. As I move the ladder, I reorganize the books bit by bit. Jeez, there are too many books. It might be too hard to set up a camera here. I knew it. Hmm, I thought so. No. Wait, I just gotta try a little harder. Hey. Kaede, I know you don't like to admit defeat, but really, it's all right. Ah, we'll figure something out. These books are so heavy. What is this, an encyclopedia? Wait! <laughs> yeah, spoken like a true musician. I know that, I know that feeling very, very well. Um... Looks like there are too many books after all. You can't really make space, can you? Aww. You're right. Uh. Right? <laughs> you look oddly uh, happy. Um. <laughs> Aww. I thought it'd be a good idea. Is that all right? It's about the places to put the cameras. We decided to place the security sensor on top of the moving bookcase, and the camera linked to it will be set up right here. That way, it will capture the moment the mastermind moves the bookcase. I, see. I suppose so. I think here and this bookcase looks good. They would have had to pass by here no matter which door they used. Yeah. yeah. Sounds good. Sounds good to me too. Ah, good old yeah. duct tape. That'll cure everything we need. We got to work. I meticulously placed the cameras in the gaps of the bookshelves. We need to set up the camera carefully so that it's aimed at the moving bookcase. Yeah. Okay. All right, so we get some good angles here. Uh, sounds good. So how will this fail? <laughs> sounds good. So how will this fail? <laughs> Pretty much. And no matter which entrance they use, the mastermind will be caught on camera. And if they move the bookcase in front of the hidden door, our sensor will detect that. And signal this receiver. Mm -hmm. And at that moment, the camera attached to the sensor will snap the critical picture. There's a 10 second delay as it starts up, so we have to leave quick. Yeah. All right, so we'll turn them on and then just bolt. All right, then that's it. Our trap has been laid. Mm -hmm. Now we just need to wait for someone to set it off. Okay. No. I'd rather focus on the plan. Besides, I'm sure everyone else is safe. Plus, once we get out of here, I'll have all the time in the world to see them. You're right. That's true. Well, let's go to the classroom. Sure, dude, sure.
Upon entering the classroom, a wave of anxiety suddenly overwhelmed me. My heart felt like it would beat out of my chest at any moment. Then... Uh, um, okay, you got the security sensor receiver? Hey! Could you hold on to it, please? I just feel like you'd be better suited for that than me. And there's a power switch on it. Make sure you don't turn it off by accident. No. No, you should hold on to it, Shuichi. You're the one who came up with this plan, and I trust you. Um. Also, Shuichi, you just said I'm better than you at something. Why do you say things like that anyway? Huh? What? You know? I guess it's good that we have some time left because I wanted to talk to you about that. Uh, um... Talk to me. What about giving him some confidence? You know? It's probably none of my business, but I think you should be more confident. Right? <laughs> yep, confidence. Especially since the Ultimate Initiative selected you as the Ultimate Detective. No. No, really. I shouldn't be the Ultimate Detective. I'm not even a real detective. What do you I'm... mean? I didn't even really want to be a detective. My uncle runs a detective business. I would sometimes help out as an apprentice. It was usually just cheating couples. Background checks. But... But one day I came across a murder case completely by chance. Uh, um... I solved it before the police did. They called me the boy detective. That's when I got scouted by the ultimate initiative. Though I only solved one case. Huh? Even so, it's still amazing that you solved a murder case. Most people can't do that. No. I wonder. I wonder if, uh, it was a really good thing I solved that case. Why? What do you mean? The look on his face when we caught him. I can still see it even now. He stared at me like he hated me more than anything else in the world. That's fucking scary. Later, I heard that. He murdered the victim to get revenge for his family. The victim was abusive. They drove the culprit's relative to suicide. Jeez. People told me the culprit was right to do what he did. The victim deserved it. But I led the police right to him. Of course he hated me. Hmm. That's not true. It's not like you took sides. You uncovered the truth. That's what detectives do, right? And yeah, the truth um, doesn't care about what side you think is more just or not. The truth is the truth. You're right. Which makes it my fault, and I'm still suffering the consequences. I'm... What do you mean? You've been afraid of uncovering the truth? I'll never forget those eyes. The hatred. The way they stared into me. Uh, um... uh, anyway, that's why I have trouble looking people in the eyes sometimes. So that's why he wears that hat. I'm... Ah, that's why he wears the hat. Okay, fair enough. I'm not a real detective, Kaede. What kind of stupid detective is afraid of finding the truth? Hmm. Kaede? I wish there was a piano here. I would play you a song to help you cheer up. Hmm, a pretty song to play for you. Oh, like Claire de Lune by Debussy. It's a soothing song that calms your heart, like the moon's reflection on water. I do enjoy that song. <laughs> you noticed, huh? Yeah, I'm shaking too. But I'd be a mess if you weren't here. I wouldn't have been able to do anything. I would have been so lost. I'm glad you're here with me, Shuichi. With you by my side, I feel like I can stand up to anything. You give me the courage Damn it, Death Hollow, no! <laughs> so please, be more confident. I believe in you, so you should definitely believe in yourself. Okay, I'll try. Good! I don't know if I can, but I'll try. Hey, try is all you need to do, buddy. Yep, that's a promise. <laughs> Fall in love with Juichi, what do you mean? After letting go of his hand, I quickly changed the subject. Yeah, that's right. Also, I think you would look way cooler if you didn't wear that hat. Huh? What are you talking about? Huh? What? I'm serious here. Do you have an ahoge underneath the hat? Aww. I just want to see everyone smile. You know? I love seeing the expressions people make when they're enjoying themselves. That's why I play piano. To see the smiles on everyone's faces. Mm-hmm. 
And that's why we need to expose the mastermind and end this dumb killing game. Ah, uh, it seems like we got two little lovebirds here. <laughs> right? Oh, because I'm Gaiety. Oh, fair enough. After our serious talk, we talked about this and that to kill some time. We did all we could and prepared for whatever happened next. I was nervous, of course. But all we could do was wait for the moment to arrive. As the time limit drew closer and closer. And then suddenly the moment arrived. Ooh, okay, who fell into our trap? Who did we catch? Who did we catch? Or did we not catch anybody? Huh? What is this weird music? Is it coming from that monitor? Could it be? Maybe it's a warning that we need to start killing. The time limit is almost up. Uh, God damn it, dude. Oh, wait, Kaede. I hear people talking in the hallway. Huh? People talking. I hear a group of boys and girls talking. Whoa, what? I saw seven boys and girls head down the stairs. Why are they all going down the stairs? Kaito, Gonta, Maki, Tenko, Angie, Himiko, and Rantaro, too? What is happening right now? Why? What's a big group like that planning to do? Rantaro was with them, too. Didn't he say he would end this game? Hmm. It's almost nighttime, right? If they're all heading to the basement right now... Could the mastermind be with them too? Kaito, Gonta, Maki, Tenko, Anji, Himiko, and Rantaro. One of them is the mastermind? No. Do I want to listen to this music for the rest of my life? No. Not really. N no. That would be bad. They'll scare off the mastermind from using the bookcase and ruin the plan. Huh? What? All right. I'm going to check out the basement. Uh, no. Now you stay and keep watch, Kaede. Okay. Just chill here. Um. Why am I all alone now? Realizing I was alone, all the fear and anxiety I was trying to hide rushed back into me. Oh, <laughs> yeah, that's true. Oh, jeez. Oh, I grabbed the broom from the corner of the classroom. I started cleaning for no reason at all. It's actually funny. My heart is pounding right now a little bit. Hey, Maxis Fox. My heart is pounding a little bit. I'm feeling anxiety, too, because now we're all alone. And shit is going down. I, I'm, I'm, I'm scared. Yeah, please come back. Okay, good. He's back. Whew. Hmm. Kaede, why are you sweeping? Ah, uh, that music is going to drive me crazy. Huh? Oh, no reason. Anyway, what about the people down in the basement? Uh, Everything's okay. okay. They all went to the game room. The game room? Why there? Ding. Everyone dies in one hour! Fuck you, bear! God damn it! <laughs> AJ, I see what you're doing there. Uh, there's only one hour until the time limit. Yeah, it's almost time. That's true. I'm sure that the Mastermind will make their move soon. If Monokuma is going to show up when the time runs out, the Mastermind will go to the library. Then it happened so suddenly. Oh! Oh! Fuck it, we got him. This music is surprisingly suspenseful. It is. I think that's what's giving me the most anxiety here. Uh, Shuichi, the receiver. That's it. Someone move the bookcase. Hurry, Kaede. Uh, Wait for me. I dropped everything I was holding and ran after Shuichi. I could feel my heart beating faster and faster. I was so nervous, my head felt like it was pounding with every heartbeat. Let's go. We're going to catch this fucker. All right. Kylie, let's go inside. Yeah. Don't you think this is a little dangerous? We should have weapons or something, shouldn't we? Uh, what are you guys doing here? Oh! Got it. Hi. Strategy what? meeting. Kylie is definitely welcome to join. Huh? Strategy meeting? Yeah. And when the time limit hits, we're going to fight Monokuma. we got a plan for that battle. 
We thought it'd be harder for Monokuma to get to the basement, so we're going to the game room. Hey. Hold on, both of you, come with us. The Mastermind is in the library. Uh -huh. huh? Mastermind? Okay. We'll explain later, but right now we need you to come with us. I do have a laser pistol, this is true! But I don't think it's gonna help me. Are you serious? Sneak attack! Alright! I'll be the one to take him down. Uh, Alright, let's go. Why do I feel like we're walking into a trap? I stepped inside the library. Oh shit. It was closing. There's no sign of the mastermind. Hmm. Where is the mastermind? What did we see? Uh-oh. Oh no! Who? You? Oh! Well shit! Rintaro's dead! Oh! My god! Wow, that's such a tease! We didn't even know anything about him! We didn't even know his ultimate ability! And this is now the now deceased Rantaro Amami. Let the despair begin. Lay dead on the ground. Well then. That happened. My and our first class trial. Deadly life begins. And it starts. Seems we've lost, lost our mystery avocado. What in the world? What the hell is going on? What is going on? <laughs> right after Tenko's scream, the front door of the library burst open, and the four people who were in the game room rushed in. What happened? What happened? Gonta, hear scream! <laughs> Uh, Ketra, thank you for the follow. Welcome to the stream. The stream of despair. Blood! So much blood! Oh, me, oh, my. oh isn't that Rantaro? What's wrong with him? Ah, uh, he's dead, lady. So much for dying within the next hour. You don't know? He's dead. Huh? What? He's dead? Well, that's unfortunate. But how? How could you be so calm? Yeah, no, they're taking this in stride. Shuichi examined Rantaro's body and placed his hand close to his mouth to check for breathing. It's no use. We're too late. No way. Too late? You mean... dead? Are you serious? He's dead? Oh yeah, wait, there's not supposed to be a class trial. Then why is there a class trial? But out of sheer desperation, I kept my mind working. I mean, it was probably a lie. It's the best I could think of. Why was he here? And... The monitor is off. It was no longer displaying Monokuma anymore. Does that mean the mastermind is dead? No, I highly doubt that. I highly, highly, highly doubt that. The killing game has started, huh? Yeah, I think so. What do you mean, maybe not? Maybe the killing game hasn't started. Maybe this just ended it. What? Ended it? What do you mean? Because... The mastermind. Rantaro was the mastermind. Huh? What? The mastermind? Uh, well, I don't um... know how he died, but if Rantaro was in the library before the time limit ended... That's true. There's a high chance that the mastermind planned this. And if he's dead... Huh? Yep. I had a feeling. A body has been discovered! Everyone, please gather in the library! Ha <laughs> ha! Here we go. Whoa, dude! You just came from the freaking side. Oh, I'm glad. The really murder took place just before time ran out. Huh? Makuma, but how? Oh, I gotta admit, I was a little nervous there because the killing game hadn't started yet. Jeez, you guys really know how to keep me in suspense. Uh, huh? My mastermind? You mean the real mastermind who's controlling me? And you think it was Rantaro? Yeah, I had a feeling that'd be way too easy. Gotta your words have no sense to them. <laughs> That's wrong. 
wrong. But hey, the victim was Rentaro Amami, the ultimate who cares. Nothing more, nothing less. Wait, what? Huh? The ultimate who cares? Uh... What's going to happen? No. He, Madokuma is wrong, isn't he? Isn't Rentaro the mastermind? Huh? Yeah, we came here as soon as the sensor went off, right? No one else was in the library. Rantaro was the only one who could have moved the bookcase. I mean, unless, here's the obvious thing. What if he just discovered the bookcase could be moved? What if he's not the mastermind? He just discovered it. We didn't tell anybody else about it. Oh, no. God. But if he was the mastermind, why is the killing game not over? Uh, um. Why is he dead? It's no use. Uh, oh. Yeah, let's, we need to check the pictures. Oh, who's here? Oh, everybody else is here. Oh no! Really? It's Oh, thank God! I thought that was a pile of dirty rags. What? I see. I see. So this ended up happening after all. My my! What a world this is! So full of jokes like this. How? What? This is a lie, right? My dearest Rantaro is dead. Oh, I mean, <laughs> was killed. Stop Dude. It. That's the same thing. Oh my god, Snarly Barrel! Thank you for the follow. Welcome to the stream. <laughs> How ironic. The guy who wanted to live ended up dead. And the guy who wanted to die survived. Either way. Huh? Nah, an explanation isn't necessary. Thanks to the first blood perk, there won't be a glass trial, so that'd just be a waste of time. Go ahead. Oh god, if you're the black and who killed Rantaro, raise your hand. Degenerate male. Degenerate male killed Rantaro, didn't he? Wait. How do you know who did it? I won't forgive you. Violent crimes are almost always committed by violent, disgusting men. Damn. Dumbass, how dare he go and get himself killed? Don't screw around. <laughs> Whoa! Hello. Hi, Cubs. It's getting interesting. Send him off in hostility like a bunch of catty popular girls. That's fine too. It's my time to shine. How gory. Nasty dick body. No, the beats crashing a funeral is way better than wedding crashing. Throw in a wedding every now and then, but the funerals are insane. Like fishing with dynamite. So whoever did this really gets to graduate, huh? Yeah, I'm a real stickler for the rules. I'm also tough on convenience store clerks. <laughs> what the frick, man? Is anybody gonna take the bait? What? No one's raising their hand. You bastards! Did you hear me? All the blacken has to do to graduate is speak up, you know. It's funny, Rantaro convinced me to live on, yet he was the first to die. What's going on? <laughs> I see how it is. The blacken has no need for the first blood perk. They would rather do a class trial. Excuse me. Oh. Very well then. Psycho! I'll give the black and what they want and hold a class trial. Oh. Yeah, why is no one coming forward? It's getting interesting. Hold on. Wait, what the heck's going on? Got it. Like we said before, we're going to hold a class trial so you bastards can find Rantaro's killer. So. <laughs> Simultaneous surgery. My heart's racing. Everyone besides the blackened will be punished. <sighs> this outcome is much worse. The culprit should have just stepped forward. Thrills, chills, kills! This is what happens when someone tries to be Komaeda with no bullshit powers. <laughs> Except for the trial where you wanted to kill either Kyoko or Makoto, huh, Monokuma? Yeah, seriously. If you don't investigate the murder, you won't be able to argue over who did it. Jeez. So you're saying we need to do the investigation ourselves, too? Hmm? Of course. The investigation is what makes the killing game so good. All right. Well, <laughs> let's think about this. So clearly that shot putt ball is what killed him. So long, Until we meet again. Adieu, adieu to you and you and you. Don't you get it? If you can figure out who the culprit is, then we'll be annihilated for sure. Huh? Be afraid, gamer. Be very afraid. Oh, God. 
I don't want to be afraid. I want to live. I want to live happily. And just a cute normal girl who can use magic, you know? Why you? You're the last person who should be calling herself cute. Then, <laughs> do you agree? Uh, okay. Impossible. Let's see. Hmm. A corpse is not simply a dead person. What the hell do you want, dude? Uh, does the black and choose to die rather than escape? I. It is true. I don't get it either. Wonderful. By coming face to face with the corpse, you will learn a great many things. Whoa! Why are you getting excited? You're not into dead bodies, are you? Actually. But is it true? Is one of us really the culprit? Hmm. Don't screw around. Hmm. On your knees. Uh. Meeny, meeny, miny, mo. Who's the killer? Only Atua knows. <laughs> Weird. So long, farewell, auf Wiedersehen, and goodbye. How exciting! That's wrong. Uh, um. Uh, Angie is now glad Atua can punish the murderer in the afterlife. Apparently, thanks for the cheers, guys. Uh, we need to trust each other and start a serious huh? investigation. Hey. We all lose our trust in one another because of this. It's all over. We have to believe in each other and investigate this case. Huh? Investigating is the same thing as not trusting each other. No. That's completely different from what Monokuma wants us to do. But... Mm-hmm. Hmm. Did I say something wrong? You were just so direct and assertive. Uh, um... I just said what was on my mind. All right! All right! <laughs> Well, the only good thing about them is that girls give birth to them. Allow Gonta. Gonta not smart. Not sure Gonta might be much help, but Gonta do his best for everyone. I... That's right. I will do my best. Okay. All right, let's do it. No one's given up yet. Yeah, of course they haven't. I can't change what has already happened. All I can do is what must be done. Otherwise, Rantaro died for nothing. I have to do it. I won't give up. We'll all escape from here. I'll make sure of it. Well then. So let's get started. I guess. Okay. Yeah. All right. We know we need to fight and survive. So let's begin the investigation, shall we? Oh, hmm. Monokuma file. <laughs> Uh, play of blood to offer. That's true. Ah! The fuck you doing here? <laughs> Don't be so crude. I've come to bring you all a wonderful present. Oh, oh. The heebie-jeebies. Ah! The death note. <laughs> God damn it! Yeah. It's a Monokuma file. You did that on purpose, didn't you? <laughs> the death note. Whether you believe it or not, it would still be prudent to examine its contents, no? Atua has spoken. He says we shouldn't take our eyes off the monopad. Okay, let's look at the monopad. Let's look at the file. The victim is Rantaro Amami. Doesn't say what his ultimate talent is. The victim's body was discovered in the library at 9.10 p.m. He was subjected to blunt force trauma to the back of his skull... Cranial fractures and immediate death. Immediate death! Okay. Yeah, well, that's obvious, but the killing game is still going on, so I'm going to assume he wasn't, right? But if Rantaro wasn't the mastermind, then who is? Actually. I know it's a little late, but seeing this makes it real. Rantaro is really dead. That's right. This is the mastermind's fault. No doubt about it. The mastermind killed Rantaro. That's... So what are we talking about? Please. Yes, we're going to have to explain yeah. the entire camera thing. Understood. So that is what happened. I was not aware you two had planned such a thing. Yes, we did use those cameras no. for that. 
Yeah. Yep, that's pretty much it. But... But if there are cameras, won't this case be solved really easily? Oh, man, that's so boring. Wait! Your amusement is the least of our concerns. We need to check the cameras right now. Then... All right, let's go. Let's get the cameras. Is that all right? Well... Because... Well, I didn't really want the camera to fall since it was aimed at the moving bookcase. Remember. Uh, um... I will do it. That's amazing! Oh, hello! I love the photo so you bastards can focus on the investigation. Because if you guys get punished, it would be way too gory. Stop it. Hey, don't butt into our... Oh. <sighs> Wonderful. I'm a strong, sensual woman. Don't underestimate me. Uh, Give those back. To me. No need to worry. We'll all have to follow the rules. We don't want to do anything underhanded or devious. So I'll let you know when I'm finished developing these photos. Wait, give the cameras back! It was pointless to yell at her. Mana Fanny was as swift as swiftly as the wind. Oh my! Aw, there she goes. Uh, no, that was important evidence. Sorry. Um, that's right. Sheesh. Kazatua is watching over us. Yeah, I'm sure we'll get the things uh, back. Um, Just, we'll have to wait. No. <sighs> now we're just in a bigger mess. A mess we have to see through to the end. Hey, uh, Kayeni, I have a proposal for you. Is that all right? If it's all right with you, could we keep working together during the trial, like we're doing now? Huh? Shuichi? I'm... I know I'm just an apprentice, but I think I can help you as a detective. No, I... I want to help you. Shuichi? Of course, with you at my side, it'll be like having a hundred people helping me. Thank you. Thank you, Kayeni. Um... I don't care about this mushy stuff, so let's just get started. Actually... What do you think? Why? In other words. Huh? Yeah, that is true. My apologies. Logical. That's right. We should be breaking off into pairs at the very least. We can definitely do it. Investigation start. Let's go near the body first. Hmm. Uh, um. No. Yes, I can do it. Don't worry about me. I'm a big girl now. I have my big girl panties on. Let's take a look at the body. Hmm. Yeah, why did he die here? That is a very good question. Was he going for one of the cameras? He moved away from the hidden door to this spot. Why would he do that? And there's no trace of his body being moved. It doesn't add up. Are you okay? Although I guess that's normal. We have to investigate a body after all. The body of someone who was alive and talking to us just a little while no. ago. It's okay, really. We just have to do our best. Not just for Rantaro's sake, but also so we can avenge him. Hmm. Hey. I am sort of a detective Please. after all. Sort of. You are a detective, remember? Okay. All right. Take a look at the body. Hmm. Leave it to me. Hmm. Blood in the back of his head. Pretty deep wound. Blood force trauma, just like the file says. And thus I now she's a girl. <laughs> um. Uh, okay. Huh? Uh, um, I'm checking what he has on his person. There might be a clue. If we're going to do this, you have to be thorough. I told you I would support you, after all. <laughs> you can slap his ass! <laughs> Come on, Kayeti. Pull yourself together. Hmm. Rantaro had in his possession the key to his room and the student handbook monopad. Okay. Um, could it be? He didn't have a card key on him. So he wasn't the mastermind. 
for sure. I mean, that would have been way too easy. Could it be? Yeah. It came from the warehouse. Hmm. There's blood all over it. Hmm. That's the murder weapon, right? I don't see anything else that could have been used. You're right. The shot itself is heavy. You would have to be fairly strong to use it as a weapon. Fairly strong, huh? Are you okay? Sorry. That's it? We're not gonna look at the blood splatter or anything? I have a theory. I think it fell from the top of the bookcase like it was planted there or something. But... How could that be possible? Could it be... He noticed the hidden door in the library just like we did. That's exactly what I thought before. Uh, um... Um... He had the same idea as us? No way, he should have told us. Uh, we could have worked together. No. Yeah, well... He was suspicious of everyone. Uh, no, I will not be doing the trial today as well. Hmm... Remember... Kaede, let's go. We can't waste time now. Yeah. Shuichi. Huh? Alright. Good. By the way. Uh, okay. It should be. Remember. Yep, there it is. No. Okay. Yeah, I made sure to switch it off on the way down here. I thought the mastermind could still be inside, and I didn't want to alert them. I see. Stop thinking until the trial. Fine. I, I'll stop thinking until the trial. Vent. The vent is still open. Hmm. Yeah. Hmm. It's true. Library vent has been added. Hmm. Huh? I'll leave it to you. Uh. Educated guess, huh? Ilias Field. Thank you for the follow. Shouldn't you be a uh, commanding berserker or something or Bazaka? Sorry. <laughs> I guess so. You're missing the most important information here. Me, damn it! <laughs> I'll get to me, you. <laughs> the way the world works is that those who speak win. That is actually a very good point. Huh? Be careful. Testimonies without evidence are powerless. Be careful. He's absolutely correct. Strange music. Oh, right. The music on the thing. Uh, okay. I can't believe it. Um. Yeah, the promotional video BGM. It's a very good point. Trashy skank. Don't talk to me, crotchage. <laughs> huh? What's the controller for? Ah. Da 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 da. It's a prone. I mean a button to your conversation, but don't you mean drone? Actually. If it was a prone, it'd team up with the rest of the Ganglion Alliance to destroy humanity. Her Heracles always goes off destroying things. <laughs> That's a fair point. <laughs> Welcome to the stream, Elias Veal. <laughs> Dick Cheese. Don't call me Dick Cheese. She laughed, ob <laughs> laughed obnoxiously and pointed her finger upward. On the latest creation from the gorgeous girl genius, Miu Iruma. 
It's a drone. I told you that's a drone. If it was a drone, it'd be leading a pack of vicious monsters. <laughs> I don't get it. When did you have time to make this? I got bored after I made those cameras you asked for. So I modified this RC plane. I even decked it out huh. with cameras so that'll take perfect aerial photographs. Interesting. From there, I'll use the photos as a reference to draft a floor plan to help the investigation. This way, I get out of having to do any actual investigative legwork. <laughs> Smart, I think. Hmm. That's amazing. I'm sure this will help with the investigation. Out of my way. Jeez. Bitch. Oh, tiny tits and shut up. Jeez. Uh, Shut up, you! My chest is way better than your nasty cow on it. Whoa! Oh, we're fighting back! <laughs> what did I do? Utters! Utters? Actually... You're a bit wimpy when someone stands up to you, huh? You're actually a complete wuss. Oh, damn! Oh, shit! Okay. A freaking drone up there. <laughs> oh, God. Why did the culprit not step forward and take advantage of the first blood perk? Huh? That is also a question. Why? Unless it was suicide. It couldn't have been suicide. Hmm. Could it have been? That's true. Huh? That is correct. Um. Do you agree? Yeah. Killing us all does seem like something. That's <sighs> right, we do. Ooh. Kaede is literally the best. And she's witnessing a fade battle between women. <laughs> um. Yeah. What did we see? Um. Or an unwary accident. Yeah, true. It could have been that as well. Hmm. The theories will keep coming. How the bookcase works. Is that all right? If I let go of the bookcase. Oh. Uh. It closes automatically. Hmm. Makes perfect sense when you think about it. If it didn't close on its own, you wouldn't be able to put the bookcase back after you went inside. I see. Okay. Uh. Maybe the reason why the bookcase closed itself was because the mastermind was hiding just past the hidden door. You're right. After killing Rantoro, they ran through the hidden door. It is certainly possible. Let's check that now. Huh? Remember. Dust on the card reader, remember? Let me guess, the dust is still going to be there. Nobody went in. I bet any amount of money. Then... Huh? Yep, it's still there. You're right. Looks like the card reader wasn't used. That means the mastermind didn't hide here. Hmm. What if the mastermind replaced the dust after they used the card reader? No. No, I remember exactly where I put the dust. This hasn't been moved at all. Okay. Fair enough. Then the one who moved the case was Rantaro. No. Oh, logically, that's what we have to agree on. I Interesting. Um... Is there anything else here? What else am I looking for? Not near the body. Front bookcase. Hmm. Remember. Yeah. Books you stacked up haven't moved. They've been left alone. By the way, 
Wait, this is a sliding door. See, it opens when you slide it. Uh, okay. Yes, I saw that. Mm -hmm. You think Rantaro entered through this door? Uh, um... I can't say for sure until we get those pictures back from the monocups. Mm. You're right, we'll just have to wait. I guess we will. We're missing something, huh? I do not know. What am I missing? I could have sworn there's nothing left for us over at the body. You know, there's nothing over here. What am I missing? We went through this door. Yes. Yeah, we saw the moving bookcase close, and then when we ran over... That's true. We found Rantaro's body behind that bookcase. Hmm. That's... Yeah, we'll, we'll be able to figure that out with the pictures. Um, right, we've investigated the entire library now. Oh, okay. Um, we just need to check everything. You're right. Yeah, once we get those photos, we'll be able to figure some stuff out. Hmm. That's true. Ah, collect some alibis. Mm -hmm. Kaito, Gonta, Maki, Tenko, Anji, and Himiko. Let's talk to them first. Hmm. Yeah. All right, we're off to the game room. <gasps> Oof, I got the hiccups now. You know what? I think I'm going to have to call it a stream here. Because I believe I've got food waiting for me upstairs and it's getting kind of late. So uh, we're going to finish the investigation and the trial tomorrow. So thanks all for coming out to the stream today. <laughs> this is getting kind of crazy. The the um This whole first portion before the investigation was very, very long. Surprisingly long. So when we come back tomorrow for the uh, for the Saturday stream... Angie please the fifth. We will continue our adventures here in Danganronpa V3 and find out who the murderer is. So thanks all for watching. This is the Musical Gamer signing off. I will see you lovely, lovely people in the next stream. Catch you guys next time. <laughs>